fictional herbalist who collects plants, who is very tended to the land of the Pueblo Cantado Chaco region. Um, but as um, as most of my family members here stated that there is an odor out there, and when you drive around, you can smell it. Um, there is a methane cloud above us that NASA has found. Um, and then also, um, to everyone in the room, you cannot measure the sacredness within this region. You say there's a 10-mile buffer zone, but then again, Chaco has many different pueblos that surround through all of it that correlates to the sun, to the moon, um, it, it, it's, it's a way that we communicate, you know, it's, a, it's a way that archaeologists have studied us in ways to, to figure that out. So you cannot measure the sacredness. And so that's why this is very important to us, because we're speaking, you know, for the plants, for the animals, for our, for our children who are in this area. Um, and then also, um, um, more than um, one in three Native women um, are abused. And within this area, there is no cell phone service, there is no substations, there is no hospitals. All of this money that we're talking about that's hurting all of these companies doesn't come back to us. It does not come back to us. So for, if we're getting, if someone gets hurt, it takes two hours for, for anyone to come out. Since it's checkerboard, Navajo Nation, the nearest substation is probably like two hours away. You know, Cuba, it's, it's, hour, it's an hour away. San Juan County. For any, like, if, if someone were to be murdered, if, if someone were to get really, really hurt, they would have to fly in. And so it's, it's, it's we're in no man's land. We're, we're on checkerboard. We don't have a say in what goes on. And, you know, when our tri-chapter yes. communities... Thank you very much. I appreciate it.